Queenslanders are leaving the dressing rooms en route now to be welcomed, of course, by this very parochial crowd, and there they go. Out onto Suncorp Stadium for the third origin of 1996. It's all been documented. The series has been won by the Blues. But this really means something to the players, and of course, as I said earlier, to the people of Queensland. Now the Blues. Unchanged. And out they go with the series well and truly in their grasp. They don't want to feel that disappointment that Ken Sutcliffe was talking about in relation to Laurie Daly and the boys in, I think it was 1993. David Manson is about to blow time on, and there it is. Origin 3 is underway in front of 40,000 at Suncorp. And Tim Brasher is the man that brings it back. Three tackles gone now, 40 out from the New South Wales line. Play by Brad Thorne, first penalty of the game goes to the Maroons. Khan, in his 12th origin, hits it nicely, and here they are. First points of the origin goes to the home side. 40 metres out from their own line, and looking sharp for Queenslanders, with a two points to nil lead, as Shearer puts his kick in, and it bounces down favourably for Rod Wisher. He comes away from the 20 and the 30. He's opened them up. The support is coming on the right. He goes back to the left and Wishart is held by Sailor. Two points to nil then. A penalty goal kicked by Willie Khan after two minutes. And then Harrigan and now Tuvi. And Johns is looming on the right. But Tuvi is tackled and put away. 35 metres out from the Queensland line. To the left they come. Into the hands of the captain. Fittler steps up the left foot twice. Then gets to the right. Rush has gone inside the 20. A floating pass. Mullins can't take it. And it's going to be a scrum to restart. But they busted them. Beautiful play from Brad Fittler. The big step. The strength of the man is unbelievable. And a beautiful ball to Tim Brasher. You've got to be critical that the outside support players weren't there quicker. Queensland on the attack. They're 15 out. They're 10 out. As Langer waits it into the end goal. And it's over the dead ball line. I fancy off the Blues. Yes, I think you'll find that Brett Mullins was forced to play at the football. He didn't want to the last tackle what will Langer do now he's going to the air with the cross kick running one way kicking back the other and what brought them a try in Sydney has failed tonight it's a well placed kick from Langer on the last three good chases there Khan ran off and Sailor the call came from the far touch judge he put the hand out Tuvi is proving a problem for Queensland as he has all series and now Harrigan offloads for Eddinghausen to promote Johns, and Johns is put down, but Coyne didn't secure the tackle. And Johns goes scampering away. Mullins is on the outside of them. Queensland have got defence in amongst them. Eddinghausen, he comes from nowhere and puts it down. Andrew Eddinghausen scoring in his 25th origin appearance. Another try. He's a freak, isn't he, Andrew Eddinghausen? He got the first one up here a month ago, and he's popped up to grab it again. Andrew Johns, beautiful work. So strong, pushing his way through tacklers. And Andrew Eddinghausen, as he does so well, backing up the score under the posts. How many tries is that for Eddinghausen? Well, it puts him up there, Eddinghausen, with the all-time try scorers. But look at Johns looking around. Eddinghausen has come from dummy half, 30 or 40 metres away, desperately chasing the ball. Got himself in a great position for that flick pass. Tuvi there, second man play for Harrigan, he's lost it, Queensland come up with it in great field position, Andrew G strolls up to the 20 metre line, Willie Khan is there, Khan tries desperately to get away, but Daly pulls him down in a try saving tackle, Khan plays it, Renoff it is, comes to the open side, and Renoff will play it now three metres away from the line. For Andrew G, a dummy half to throw an ordinary pass. Shearer, he can't pick it up cleanly. Larson dives on it. So Queensland really bumbled their way through that play. Then it's Langer using Jason Smith. Langer's with him on the outside. Oh, the pass went away for Billy Moore. And it seemed that a try has gone begging. Well, the anguish on Billy Moore's face says it all. 
Alfie Langer couldn't have done any more there. A great ball back on the outside from Jason Smith. Bring the many advantage, and I do question whether it was necessary. Back in your own territory. Scoreboard's not too bad. Here's a good run down the inside of Mark Coyne came Jason Smith. And then the Blues can't capitalise on the advantage. Well, Shearer is starting to create a little bit of havoc out there. The two Willie Kahn bust for results of Shearer's passes. And so too was Mark Coyne getting into some space on the outside. A very good tackle once again by Stephen Menzies in cover defence. Came up with one earlier on Willie Kahn, which stopped a very dangerous situation. Jason Smith has taken a very heavy knock to the head. There was no foul play involved. And it's not the first time we've seen Jason on the end of uh, an injury in state of origin. Alan Langer then to the defensive line. Now this will bring a penalty. And it will be against Adam Muir for mine. Well, Fiddler that... coming in to ask the question. And Adam Muir, he was, he was livid that this decision has gone against him. He's claiming that he didn't have to get out of the way of Alan Langer. And will kick for goal. Hits it. And has just squeezed it a little bit outside. 12 metres out from the Queensland line. For Tuvi and Fittler to combine. For Dimmick out wide to switch it. Back through Fittler and then Daly. Two decoy runners for Ainsco. Who chips it ahead once. Kicks it again. Dives for it. It's there. But uh, Renoff is there as well. Now, Ainsco, was he pulled out of it is the question. Oh, brilliant work there. Individual stuff from Jamie Ainsco. Wendell Saylor comes across now. He's kicked to the football. It's all clear. Dimmick in for Fitler. And there it goes. Heading for the upright. It's a great kick. And I think yes, I think yes. It's a try scored by Mullins. The combination has worked again. Mullins has got his third origin try for the year. And he's having a great time at the end of the kicks that Andrew Johns and this time Brad Fittler are putting up. It was a beautiful bomb. Very well positioned. The chasers coming in. I think Brett Mullins is offside myself, but the call's been OK. And look at him fly above everybody, and there was plenty of traffic involved. Wishart now with this one. So Wishart converts the try scored by Brett Mullins. A bit unfortunate for New South Wales. Their best player in the first half, I thought Andrew Johns, is off for the set whole of the second half with the shoulder injury. More bad news for Queensland. Jason Smith won't be returning again tonight. The important thing for Queensland now is to not get frustrated or panic. We've still got 30 minutes left in that, this game. That's ample time to score enough points to win this match. What they've got to do is to make sure they don't come up with mistakes. Like Here's a chance one. for the Blues. Quick work by Fittler, linking up with Brescia. Brescia gives it on. Mullins was looking for his second try. Mullins also looking for support there, no one backing up. Well, it all happened so quickly, Jim Dimmick now trying to force home the advantage of a quick turnover. What happened? Tony Hearn lost the ball. It was jolted out in the defence. Now Fittler to the right for Daly, drifting across for Eddinghausen to go back. And Eddinghausen takes the tackle, but it's a high shot. Wishart now from close range, and he pilots it straight over the black block. Willie Kahn has been brought off in a, a fairly healthy state. More though for Queensland, more chances as Lamb goes on. He's on his way, pulled down two metres out from the line. Can they go on with it though? Lamb plays it back, Singh gave it for Dallas. Dallas is held, Singh goes in to try and push him over the line. Still on the line. So desperate is it now? Well, Dallas plays it for Walters. And then Lamb was taken by Eddinghausen. The ball has been batted over the dead ball line. Oh, disappointment on the bench here. Tim Brash was absolutely smashed in running the football out. And Adrian Lamb picked up, looked as though he might scoot the 30 metres to score. But David Ferner coming across. Pressing for a converted try. And then, oh, Alan Langer has been taken high. A hand went out from Dean Pay. Quick tap taken by Alfie. Well, he's got to get 10 in the bin there. Yeah, Timmy Brass has got to go here for 10. I don't think there's a send-off offence against Dean Pay on Alan Langer, but they'll be short of one player for the next 10 minutes at least. And that's what the sin bin is for.
The Queensland send Andrew G into the defence. Walters is there, and Walters is a couple of metres out. He tried to get it away. He lost the ball. The Blues have turned defence into attack through uh, Brett Mullins. Fittler then with a chance for drop goal from way out. I'll tell you what, it's a great kick. Well, Brett Fittler confidently has kicked at something like 35 metres and straight between the uprights for 15 to 2. And more importantly, it's now put his side 13 in front. 10 metres out from the line, a chance to put it over the line again for what would be their third try as it comes across now for Daly. He kicks ahead for Mullins, the race is on! And I think off the fingertips of Matt Seek. Another planned move from New South Wales where they go one side and back the other. Adrian Lamb has hurt his shoulder in saving a try here. Mullins and Wishart were both zeroing in. No wonder Adrian Lamb has hurt the shoulder. He took the full brunt, the weight of Rob Wishart. From the line, Langer playing his 27th origin match tonight. The ball batted back by Coyne. It's play on. It's been touched in flight. The tackle count has restarted. And uh, played by Dallas, Coyne tries to burrow his way through. Played, played forward and he puts a hand on it. It's a try, I think. Yes, he's given the try, David Manson. Mark Coyne got up, played the ball. You can play it in any direction. And he's put a hand on it. Not the prettiest try scored by Mark Coyne. In fact, he probably scored the best one we saw a few years ago, but he's... I don't think he even meant to play it forward. <laughs> he he stepped on it and dived over. Oh, can you believe it? What about Dallas? Did he have a hand in the play of the ball? No, he did not. But Mark Coyne oh. has been awarded a try. Willie Carr converts. 15 points to eight with five and a half minutes on the clock as Langer goes back for Walters. And then he provides for Sailor. And this is Matt Singh. Sing around Ainsco, inside for Coin, further in for Dallas. Dallas is on his way. Oh, this little red-headed winner. One of the great finishes. Puts it over the line. 15 to 12 now. Oh, tremendous work there from Queensland. And it was Matty Singh who set it up by getting around Jamie Ainsco. And just the speed here. Look at Singh around Ainsco. Ainsco eventually gets him, but that great pass from Coyne left Mullins on the ground. Tuvi can't catch him. They're back in it. Well, Matt Singh was able to put Jamie Ainsco back on his heels. And once a quick man like that can achieve that in a defender, he's halfway in getting around him. And refusing to lie down. Khan is spot on with his kick. Walters comes left. Lang drops it on the boot. They all look onside to me. Brash has made a mistake, and then it was kicked by Fiddler, who was in front of him. Six more tackles for Queensland. Should have been a penalty. Fiddler was offside for mine. That was the penalty. Then across to Andrew G. He's put down 15 metres out. Walden, he'll look for Langer. He's on the left. He's with it now. And Langer is held there. They'll hang on as long as they can, but they mustn't get a penalty. He's almost down on his feet, Langer. Walters away for G, and then for Billy Moore. And Moore gets it away. G floats it out. They've got the overlap. Dallas has to come back in, and Dallas is put down 12 metres out. 40 seconds left. Walters then. He gets inside the tackle, takes it within two metres of the line. He'll play it on tackle five. Then from Singh. Now with Langer, he stops, rolls it into the end goal. Yeah! Coyne, Coyne has put it down, but he's offside. He's offside. Yeah, Mark offside. Coyne is offside, and the penalty has been given to the Blues. Oh, sit down, Gary Belcher. He was 20 metres offside. We've got to see it again. Langer gets to the line and steps inside a couple of players. Where's Coyne? He's only three metres offside. They can't get a break. What are you saying? It should have been allowed. Oh. The siren goes, they would have had a kick to win it, but the fists are raised by the New South Wales captain. What a match. Yeah, what a match. And what a series. As uh, New South Wales eventually are able now to celebrate their clean sweep of the 96 series. 
winning this match by one point.